So a recap of SmackDown. The first SmackDown of the season. The debuts on Fox. With the opening segment. The Rock is first the McMahon. So it's off to a bad start. Stephanie, Vince, right? We don't need to see him on TV that much. They could take 10 years off from TV. Please do. And then The Rock. And then Corbin comes out. And then The Rock comes out. I thought it was going to be okay. I thought it was going to be like... What's the part that I thought was going to be good? Um, I don't know the part that was bad. But the part that was good is sort of... It was on the ringside news. Um, he called him a Burger King cosplayer or something like that. Which was like, okay, that's pretty funny. That's what something The Rock would do. The Rock did a good promo, Some, so I thought, from the Ringside News post. Legit Rock stuff, legit Attitude Era stuff, made this get interesting. He's feeling comfortable with the promos, etc. Then he calls him a Comic-Con cosplaying virgin, which is really not cool. First off, your whole demographic goes to Comic-Con. I think this was a thing at All Elite Wrestling. But it ended up worse because you took a dig at the WWE audience. And the second part is that nobody shames people for being virgins anymore. There's no taboo with that anymore. There's a whole bunch of people who are asexual. They do stuff with that. Like, I get it was the Attitude Era stuff. But imagine if he had used the N-word or the F-word or something else that was terrible. Like people say the attitude error should come back, but this just showed why it shouldn't come back. Because, like, a lot of the stuff they did was out of date. Like, GX shooting white liquid at people. Like, all the stuff was, like, Russo ridiculous. I don't think it should happen again. What are your thoughts? Like, I'm scribe.